Tech time, if you do repetitive tasks on your iPhone, iPad, or even your Apple Watch, <laughs> you can automate them by creating workflows. Technology consultant Francie Black is here to show us how it works. Sounds a little advanced. Yeah, yeah, well it okay. can be. It can be simple or you can do advanced workflows. But the idea is, let's say that you do something repetitively on your phone. So I'm gonna use an example maybe for you. So maybe every day you take a picture of your daughter and you put a certain frame or filter on it and then you post it to Facebook. Okay. So rather than going to two or three apps to do that, you can create a workflow that will automatically, with a single tap, take you through those steps and sequentially do it and do it in a much quicker time oh, frame. Oh, interesting. Okay. Yeah. So a couple other examples. And by the way, this app is it's it's really cool. But Apple actually just bought the company, the app. So um, yeah. So it's going to be really neat. It's going to continue. Which is like your dream if you make apps <laughs> is to have Apple buy it. Exactly. So um, just a couple other examples. So this can be for work or um, our personal use. But another one is like, let's say, email your schedule to yourself. So it can look at your calendar, grab all of your events for the day that you've got going on, maybe out in the field or whatever, and it will send you a schedule of what you've got going on. Now, maybe you need to send it back to the office or maybe to a worker, or maybe you're in the office and you need to send it out to a worker. So you could even do that to somebody who's out in the field. Okay. And again, single tap, pulls all the information and sends it to you. Great. Okay, so those are a couple of examples. Now, if you want to get started with this app and play around with it, the easiest way to do that is what's in the gallery. And the gallery has hundreds of examples that, um, you know, for morning routine, explore Apple Music, all kinds. There's literally, you know, hundreds of them that you can play around with. Brush your teeth timer <laughs> is on there. I mean, really. <laughs> So I'm going to actually show you how to make a, um, a workflow, okay? So we're going to create one. We're going to say create workflow and um, then swipe over to the left and then you can see all of the different actions that you can do within your workflow. And it can be anything. There's contacts, documents, maps, music, photos, and videos. And that's what we're going to work on. So I'm going to say we're going to take a photo okay. and I'm going to drag that little action over and then we're going to edit the image. And then the last thing we're going to do is we are going to share it on social media. And I'm going to say post to Facebook. Okay. And in the editing, I'm going to choose that you could do any of these. You could say you want to enhance it, add effects, frames, and so forth. I'm going to say frames. Okay. okay. So now we're going to run our workflow. Okay. So it's going to walk through the steps. There we go. Okay. Launched my camera. I'm going to do a behind the scenes shot in the studio here. We got our cameraman hiding there. And I'm going to go ahead and say use photo. Okay, and so we edit it. It's gonna take us to our frames, which I asked it to do. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna add a frame to it. I added this little white border. You can do other ones if you want to. I'm gonna go ahead and apply that. And say done, you can do other effects if you want to. And then the last thing it's gonna do is walk me through and now it's gonna post it to Facebook. And you can add your text to it and Already say pulls it right up. Don't have to and log in or anything. Exactly, so really quick, much faster than doing that by going through multiple apps to do that. Now the last thing I want to show you down here at the bottom is where it says add to home screen. Okay, So rather than going into the workflow app to actually access that, you can add it as an icon to your um, to your home screen. Nice. And uh, let's see if I can get it. Oh, lost my picture there. Are you going to come up? There you go. And um, so anyhow, so you can add them as icons onto your home cool. screen and so you tap it once and there it goes right there and you can even add you know i did a personal one where you can make you know self gifts and things like that so this is a really full featured app there's tons that you can do with it i've got a lot more of that information on my website if you want to get it by email shoot me an email at info at ipadwisdom.com and just put subscribe and i can email that out to you all right you can also find all that information at tech time on the wls website thanks so much for